RCCG panics after Iluyo Madis resigned to establish their own church. Yes, of course, we know all the buhaha going on since the death of uh, Wigwe and some members of his family, his wife and his son. And uh, people, even people who are not even in the mission, uh, commission of a, a RCCG, they all came out. I think it is as a result of the outcry of Nigerians who are not even part of the church that made the the church said they are going to um, do or maybe serve them punishment and all of that. But at the end of the day, the whole thing was just there was tension all over the place. Then they had not even lead Wigwe and his family, his uh, two family members, uh, to lead them to rest. And I believe that that was the reason why they just, the leadership of RCC just kept everything, you know, in a cooler. And I believe that there must be some other things going on, even in the church, before now. But they will not say it. there's always politics everywhere. Somebody always say even in a family there is always politics. People try to play politics, especially when you have a extended family or a large family at that. Oh, there's no way politics will not be played. So when you see politics in the church, it is a, uh, it is uh, understandable, but nobody could really pinpoint what. The problem was in that uh, ROCCG circle and the city of David where Iluyo Mades were pastoring because as it is now, they are no longer there. So, the cocoa of the matter now is that the man has been transferred. I think after how many months, the incident happened in February, March, April, May, June. So, it is this June, after four months, the leadership of ROCC now deemed it fit to do the needful. And what did they do? Some people say suspension, but it's more it's transfer, but it's more or less like suspension. It's just like a when you are at level. Let me use that as an analogy example. You are at level ten, and some they now brought you back to level two. Of course, they are not telling you bringing you to level one or level zero because once you once they bring you to level zero, that means you are even out of the equation. So somebody who is at level ten, they now bring you back to level two. What does that tell you? It's just one step for you to be out of the equation. So you should use your tongue to count your teeth. So it's as good as you say they transfer him and where you transfer him to it's like a demotion to the you know to the background. For some for somebody who understands the whole thing. So that it won't be as if uh, oh we are the ones who ask you to leave or oh, uh -huh. we are still telling you to go and be a leader or oversee some departments of course the man could not even be his before you could see jack robinson within one week the man just resigned bah, bah. now the man has resigned we know the politics about uh, where he was the trinity house or tower how they built it the money they spent and the man that even helped them he can't, of course is the reason why this okatakata is happening because they did not uh, give him that uh, respect which is understandable we know that say the Iluyo Madis, they goofed. They goofed very well. So that is a by the wayside. And some people were of the opinion that if they then remove that man from there, he will tell them that he's not going to go. But I think uh, the man has seen it all. He just said, you know what, I don't want to crazy him in our left. But now, because don't forget, as soon as he was transferred to Ibu Temeta, and they brought another pastor, and they said the pastor that came, that he was not giving that full recognition you know you could you could sense it that these guys do not really want me and a lot of people have been making have been threatening that hey, if they remove ilu yamade from that uh, city of david which is a city house okay if they remove him that they all will all will go with him and that has always been what has been happening in redeem once somebody they like you know people who want to like i'm going to follow this man no? so they are afraid that this man is going to go and get a another church or because i don't expect him to just sit down or to go and join another church at this age and time because i believe those people must have spent if not up to 30 years you know being in the redeem so the best thing they know how all of these things please and when you talk about a uh, you know bringing simba and caliber to a particular parish they know how to do it it's just all of, oh you know a matter of a uh, their their cronies 
they will just follow them. So what will that be the fate of uh, the city of David, the Trinity Tower? How is it going to be? And that is one of the fears of the of the ROCCG. But they ought to have known that this kind of a thing will happen. So why are they afraid? You cannot eat your cake and have it. It is it is it is it is it is a short thing. You cannot eat your cake and have it. When you have brought the person down to that level, what do you expect? Or maybe they thought uh, it will still be managing, be managing, or come and beg this and that. And at the end of the day, they do not say uh, this and that. But you can't eat your cake and rabbit. You can't put, bring that person to that uh, level and you expect him to stay back. He won't stay back. A lot of people have said that they uh, ah, so go and be seeing the affairs of the elderly ones in that uh, Buzi Meta. It's not going to work. Early work. And what are we seeing? So definitely they have their friends all over the place especially in that particular parish all of them will just switch you know woman being they switch no matter what like i always say even the devil he get fans no matter how bad somebody did who can be worse than devil yes the devil some people will still defend him some people will still back him up so it is like that if you think hey, this person is not good don't worry the people will go like with i still say b now so they will like her just like he's saying that uh, um, one man's meat is another man's poison. What you don't like, another person might like it. So that is the fear now. Because you see that the uh, majority of the people who want to follow him. But don't forget, according to uh, the Bible, that the church of God, when Jesus said, I will build my church and the gate, gate of hell shall not prevail, uh, shall not prevail. So it could happen in that way, but humanly speaking, mm -hmm, human being will behave like human being. That is what we are talking about. That they are panicking, and uh, they know that a lot of people will want to follow the man in large numbers. But let's see how how things say uh, uh, we unfold or are unfolding. Let's keep our finger crossed. We'll um, relate another obvious with you as soon as we get them. Thanks for always been there. Bye.